What's up, everybody? My name is Stephen A. Smith from ESPNN, and you're watching HoopJab.com. Check it out. Surprisingly good. Um, I agree with Chair from the standpoint that I thought Connor won the first two rounds. I thought he won at least one additional round, and Floyd won all the others. But I will tell you this. Floyd walked him down. He stalked him. And what I saw was an individual in Conor McGregor who deserves a lot of credit because he fought better than anybody anticipated. All right, those first two rounds, he caught Floyd with a nice uppercut. He was using the jab effectively on a couple of occasions. And then after that, it was more pity patting and keeping his arms down defensively. He didn't seem that great. Floyd didn't seem well. He didn't seem sharp. I'm glad he announced his retirement after this fight and made it official because if he were in there against a young lion that happened to be a professional boxer, I think it would have been a different outcome based on how he looked tonight. Didn't look sharp. Missed a lot of rights. Missed a lot. He was hit shots to the body, but missed a lot of those overhand rights that he was throwing. But in the end, Conor McGregor deserves a lot of credit because I didn't expect him to survive this long, and he did. He made a good showing for himself, even though he needs to go back to the UFC.